I did a video on this. Uh, I can't remember when, um, but it was a while ago, and I'm deciding to continue the series now. Um, this is I forgot about for a long time. Um, so right now I have all the uh, necessary ingredients to. Um, Craft a uh, sea truck. I have not got to her permissions for that information. Okay. I can't help you if you don't tell me. Which data format do you accept? Words, Words mostly. Mostly. I have the information to your data type. Thank you. Thanks. Listen, I need something to call you. We do not use words that way. I used to have a pet barwell. I called him Ketchup. Don't make me name you two. You may append my seed cell to the species designation. You may call me Al Alba. I waited my whole life to meet a spacefaring alien. You're telling me your name is Alan? Is it sufficient? No. No. Alan. It's perfect. Let me see about that vessel. All right. Now, I've already got the uh, mobile vehicle bay up. Um, as you can see, I have uh, all the materials. I do have a plastic kit. Um, I'll tell you why. So, if we go to. Actually, you know what? How much is a. Uh, I can best need go to tank. Two glass, one silver ore, and okay. Struck. I'm gonna save right here. So if my gig crashes. <laughs> Whoops. More like actually more like 40%, because I think it's I think it's about forty percent slower than uh, the Seamoth. But look, I can uh, move diagonally, and it feels kind of fast. Is it faster than the uh, than in the in the final game? I actually wonder. Sanctuary. Sam, what is this about? Just routine. I poked about, took some scans, nothing happened. Okay, I got the ghost. Easy. How, how come I can't interact with the... Oh well, wah wah. The data suggests your colleague was aware. I had to see some time. Life. There are many humans, and only one me, but survival is apparent. Goofy, ah, voice. Where am I? What is this? Am I in the deep Arctic? Yeah, I am. I can tell by these two things right there. Oh, of course, there's a ghost Leviathan right there. Oh, snap! I'm below crush depth. All right. Passing I have an idea. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. You guys want to watch me uh, go down there? I don't have a sea glide, so this is going to be absolutely terrible. I'm probably going to die, but you know what? I don't care. Yeah. 
You know what? I'm gonna take some of these. All right. All right. We're good. Who are you? I just want to talk. Pronsu leads in uh, threateningly. Pronsu is deactivated, revealing a human pilot inside the cockpit. I. This is horrible. This is horrible. Why did I do this? All right, you light up my way, sir. You be my light source. Let's be friends, okay? Let me feed you. Let's be friends, all right? All right. Hey, where'd you go? Be my friend. No. Oh my god. I hate this. I hate this so much. I'm going back up. You know what? I, I ain't dealing with this. I'm not dealing with this. Go back up. Come on. Do a jumping jack. Okay, so can you stop causing earthquakes on 4546B? It, it damages the ecosystem. Uh, sorry, Mr. Um, Locker. You're, I'm gonna leave you right there. You are probably not gonna. Um, uh, be a, in my journeys around uh, 4546B. I don't know why, but I feel like early access just gives me this vibe, um, this version, along with the first one, like the one before this. It gives me some sort of vibe that I like. Like, I really like it. It's just some sort of vibe. It's like exploring a long lost game or something. I think that's what it is. Alright. Glass, lead, diamond. Glass. Glass, lead, diamond. Uh, now how do we make it? Oh. Um. I got the stuff. What do we need to do now? Don't tell me I need to build a moon pool. Oh my god. You know what? I don't care. I have a better idea. Let me look. Oh. Just that. Alright. Um. What was it? Copper wire. Alright. 
it's somewhere around there. I know it because I remember it from memory. You'll see it, Papa. You will. Hey, get out of my face. Please, it's not again. Come on. There he is. There he is. You guys can see him. You guys can definitely see him, right? Yeah. There he is. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay away from that. Um, I don't want to get myself got. Uh, definitely. Um, probably not gonna make it out in time. But you know what? It is what it is. You know, it is what it is. Alright, here we are. Just need to get in there, take the stuff, and leave. Move out of the way. I told you not to follow me, Altera. Now you got a problem. Don't care. I'm out of here. New blueprint acquired. All right. Now we're gonna get out of here. All right. Oh no, we're we're definitely dead, guys. We are dead. We are dead. We are dead. Let's get the heck out of here, man. I just want to get out of here, man. That's all I need. I just want to get out of here, man. I'm going to get over to that area. But the problem is, I think there's a Leviathan guarding this area as well. But that, this is where I want to go in order to, to progress. Like, I just got the orange thing. Right? You know what I mean by orange thing. Right guys? The orange tablet. I think this is either a ghost leviathan in this area or a reaper. I cannot remember. I think it was a reaper. If it is a ghost leviathan it's a juvenile one. Well if it's a juvenile one then you know. Oh no. I'm near that uh, reaper spawn, so I just wanna I have an idea. I'm gonna stick along to the edge of the wall, and I think we'll be safe. All right. Once we get um past this Leviathan or whatever, we are good. Stay much closer to the wall so it doesn't get me. Because I know it's gonna get me. So I distinctly remember spawning in the Yeah, right there where I'm looking. That's where I remember putting it. Should I do a series like this, but like on the, the latest version or something? Maybe on experimental? I'll have a story disabled, I can just call it like Subnautica Below Zero except um, adding my own story to it or something like that, that would be nice. Would you guys like that? I mean, I... Uh, I, I think I... I might have told my father about that like a long time ago. Not like below zero, but like just Subnautica in general. Spawn this to that. I guess kind of make your up, up your own story or something. I, I believe I might have told him about that. And if, it, if not, it's probably me. I, I probably just told my brother about that. And if not, 
to take us and Alan and stuff. If you guys are worried about that, might take Alan and do experiments on him. But this ending, you know, you're just gonna, you're gonna see, you're, you, you'll see, you'll see. All right, guys. I'm gonna enjoy this moment right now. I'm just gonna look at the sky. Look at this terrain. This little lake here. It's nice. Alright, we're getting closer to our destination. There's the ice cave, or the entrance that you couldn't get to at the beginning of the game. Because, like, once you um, finish Alan, or finish constructing Alan, you sh yeah, you're supposed to go through this bi that biome that I just went through to get all the way over here. And the biome is called Hover Zone 3. Now, it didn't make it to the final game. Uh, I don't remember why. There was a pretty valid uh, reason. Maybe, maybe it wasn't. I don't know. Alright, I mean the terminal thing's already open for some reason. I'm just using that tablet to see. Ending cutscene, it's a secret. That's not what I wanted to show you guys. Let me open up free cam. What's, what's over here? Nothing. Okay, what's over here? Oh, that's an elevator thing, right? Yeah, there's an elevator. We'll look at that in a little bit. I just want to show you the ending first. If I can find the uh, terminal for it, let me change it to day. It's not easy to find the terminal, guys. I'll just say that. Is it even in this version? I can't remember. It is, right? Is this the terminal down here? No, right? Um, there it is. I found it. I found it. I found it. Let me just... The Vesper has exploded. And the credits are now playing. Yep. So you know that spaceship that Sam's in? It's gone. Or it should be. And then the credits are now playing. Awesome. Anyways, let's let's go to the precursor place. This place right here. Let's go up the elevator. <laughs> All right. Let me just show you what it's like. Um, I don't know what to say about uh, this area right here. This room, I should say, to be more specific. And what is this room for? I have no clue. Maybe you were supposed to meet Alan there or something. Or maybe there was something there that you could deactivate the shield and then walk out. You know? And if we call down here... There's a place that leads down there. Oh. Ow. And there's a place that leads here. 
Now, I don't know what this is. This could be a room. I mean, look. There's no room in there. Okay. Might have been a room. No way. And then you're supposed to go down here. And then you could walk outside and I think from there you I think you'd have to move all the way over there and this is where the terminal is where you explode or is this it? I think that's it where you explode the Vesper and I think over here this is where Al is supposed to turn into like a, a spaceship and then you fly fly away I'm sorry for gore and game spoilers, by the way. Sorry. Womp womp. <laughs> There's nothing down there, by the way. I like how I can just view this area right here. It's nice, actually. Guys, yeah, just uh, look at the view of this place. Look at that. Whoops. Wrong button. There. That's nice. I'll take a screenshot of that. That's beautiful. Now that the Vesper is, I mean, it's right there, but uh, canonically it's it's exploded, all right? But let's pretend that thing's gone. It's exploded, right? Now that the Vesper is gone, we can just sit here and do whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.